I think CBDCs are great advertisements for Bitcoin. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah, a, lot right. of people, a lot of people think it's going to displace Bitcoin. I'm like, no, it literally strengthens the case for Bitcoin. Yeah, so right? true. Because yeah. literally they can just shut off a switch and that's your money. It's it's just shut off. It's controlled. It's, you know, it's it's in like a, a bucket that you can't get it out from. Um, and so, you know, really it, it's, it's, it's not that Bitcoin's digital nature is not what makes it interesting. It's the scarce decentralized aspect mm-hmm. that makes it interesting and that's something that cbdc's lack they're just they're just fiat currencies in a new form and you know the banking sector is still basically the same it's just that the cash part the part that's issued by the central bank is digital yeah and so instead of this private medium of exchange that has the downside of moving pretty slowly cash dollars you instead have this highly surveilled controlled thing but it, it has the convenience of moving quicker much like you know bank deposits do yeah um and if we've seen, for example, I mean, in Nigeria, they launched their uh, CBDC in 2021, and it has like 0.5% adoption. And everyone's in Bitcoin and stable coins and things like that instead. They, yeah. they don't want that. You know, why would you want? It's like, it's like, the, the, it's still inflating like the Naira is, you know, it's, it still has all the problems of a, a inflationary fiat currency. And so they either want the stronger fiat currency like the dollar, or they want Bitcoin things like that yeah. um and as far as will they make bitcoin illegal and people have been saying that for 14 years now um it's there's almost 200 different jurisdictions right so each one has different influence of what they want to do generally speaking if it, the ones that are more restrictive on it are authoritarian countries that, that don't want capital flowing out they're more, they're more likely to impose restrictions if 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 you don't have that problem if you're actually a freer country uh, it, one, it's hard for you to make Bitcoin illegal because, yeah. you know, you're saying you can't run this open source code peer to peer in your computer. Well, good luck enforcing. That's expensive to enforce. Yeah. Um, you can't roll a dice. So if you roll a dice, if you if you flip a coin 256 times, you can generate a private key, and someone can send you Bitcoin from another country. That's interesting. Yeah, I, yeah. it's like I haven't even used a computer. I just, you know, um, so literally, it's, it's like math problems. You have to make yeah. math legal. Now, you can add frictions. So a common thing is you don't make it legal, but you cut it off from the banking system because that's easy to do. Yeah. Because you're not enforcing on the individual users. You're forcing it on the banks. And so Nigeria, they said, okay, here's a CBDC. Oh, also, we're cutting off all fund flows from banks to crypto exchanges. That'll kill it. Instead, you still have higher adoption of crypto than the central bank digital currency. Um, so it really depends on what jurisdiction you're talking about, how weak their money system is, how much how much the supply inflation is going up, uh, how prone they are to seizing and censoring accounts, um, and how good uh, the developers are on the other side and Bitcoin and, and stable coins and things like that of making their products more and more useful. Mm-hmm. Um, I just got off a venture capitalist call, you know, basically just developing uh, applications to make it easier and easier and easier to uh, – hold bitcoin move bitcoin on a smartphone uh do peer-to-peer exchanges right so you don't need onboarding you can even exchange central bank digital currencies for bitcoin because you can say okay i'm going to sell you this chair for central bank digital currencies and oh actually i'm selling you bitcoin but the app doesn't know that we know that right <laughs> that interesting. so it, it's, yeah. it's peer-to-peer inflows right wow, and so cool. yeah